Hey guys, it's me Callie, and today I'm going to be talking about my Zamboni experience part 2. I'm doing this because I got a complaint not long ago about my last video, so I just wanted to answer some of those questions and get it so that everyone has an understanding of what is that video about. So to first preface it, one of the biggest complaints that I got was that I called it Zamboni instead of an ice resurfacer job or like operations but for the just respect of the YouTube video I said Zamboni because I didn't want people to not understand what I was talking about because most people want to if I talk to them and say hey it's an ice resurfacer they're like a what and like usually I have to put like a picture right there and that's how I get people to understand what it means so I did not want to make it anyone upset about how I said that, but that's just how I did it, so that's what I said. I also want to say that I, that's how, what we call the job at work, we're just the ZAM driver, and I will say ZAM a lot rather than ice uh, operations or ice resurfacer. And so, to get to my next point, I also, if I'll link the other video down below so you can see it and understand what I was talking about in the next part but so I when I was talking about when I started we had two positions called cleaners and not and like operations but like you're still operations and cleaning so it was, what was it it was all operations but one was maintenance while one was cleaning so I got a complaint that it wasn't I was calling it an internship but what I meant was that it was just a program we had at the time that was taking high school students so and then just having them clean and over time you would gain the knowledge of the Zamboni it wasn't an internship because you're getting paid and you're still doing everything the only thing you're not doing is cleaning the ice or cutting the ice or however you want to say it this whole entire video is all my opinions and so I did not want to make anyone upset and I'm trying to phrase that because this is all my opinions I am just because I work the job does not mean I have full liability or whatever you want to call it over the idea. To add more to my experience, I did work more past that point that I made the video. And to like preface it, uh, go on, Zamboni or Zam drivers, it's a fun job for the most part, which in the last one I was being very like, girls have a tough time and the person that one of the people that complained was a girl, and I understand that they were a ZAM driver, but at my t place there was just no one who was in that position, besides me and another co-worker. So it was just more of that was my experience, and I'm not trying to say that we're the only girls, but like, no, we were just, that was our experience. To continue, it, Zamboni jobs are fun for, when you're, for the most part. I got to work an event where I got to pretty much meet some really big people, like, Olympians, past Olympians, NHL players, and that was just all from working there. And I value a lot of my time I had there. And I mean, if you really want to go out and try to do it, but you just have to know that it's going to be hard and that there's a lot that behind it at that. And that a lot of people are going to always ask you about the Zamboni. Like they won't know what it is or they'll ask for a ride and you'll just be like, yay, funny heard that joke before or that you'll get Deadpool jokes a lot or any other joke that involves something with a Zamboni and so pretty much any Ryan Reynolds movie so I just I know this is a short video and I've been doing a lot of short videos lately but I just wanted to make this so that you guys understood what I was trying to say in a really far past video if you like how I did my hair and makeup today you can comment down below and if you want to see it, or you can, or you can comment what else you want to see. Um, so I will see you guys next week. Comment, like, subscribe, and.